Hey everyone, 13th Wolfman here. You know what? My Cyber Monday... My Cyber Monday order came in. There you go, yeah! I'm going to show you what I picked up. I've been waiting a while to, to do this video, so... It might be a little bit high. Sorry. Going in alphabetical order, I guess. I didn't even plan to do it this way. I just grabbed them and... So the first thing that came in was the sci-fi show called Being Human Season 1 on Blu-ray. This, uh, I started... Years, when it first came on, I watched like three or four episodes, thought it was a cool show. Kind of got lost, you know, um, didn't, didn't stay, didn't stay true to following it. So I just figured once, one day I'll pick it up and just watch the full season, and I really like season one, so definitely gonna pick up season two. They got this from Amazon for like 11 bucks or something like that on Blu-ray. How cool is that? Season one of Being Human, which is based off the the British show Being Human. Now here's the thing: there's four seasons of the American show, and each season's about season is about uh, 13 episodes long. So that would give us 52 episodes in total. The British show is only like eight episodes long, five seasons, and like. 40 episodes. We got like an extra 12 episodes to this show as compared to the other show. And I'm kind of, I would love to watch them both to see how they, how they co-mingle with one another. Are they, are the storylines, I mean I know that, I know that there's a vampire, a werewolf, and a ghost in the, in each show, but did they, did they just take the idea of the show and make their own storylines for the American show, or did they actually follow some of the storylines from the British show? So I'd like to see that. Alright, so that's the first thing, being human. Now, as you guys heard me whine and complain on about Black Friday, I didn't get to pick up any any Simpsons uh, stuff, well, not any, but the Simpsons stuff that was at Target for like $5 a piece. So, went on, again, this is all Amazon stuff, so, went on Amazon and picked up Seasons 11, yeah, with Krusty on it. There we go. And seasons, tw and seasons, and season twelve, with Jeff Albertson on it, A.K.A. Comic Book Guy. Yeah. So that leaves me with one season left. I just need to pick. I could have picked up season thirteen at the time, but I just felt like I kind of like just getting them when I can. That way, I'm not overwhelmed with too many of them. Right now, i got four seasons to watch. I've got 11, 12, 16, and 17. So, I mean, really, do I need another one? 13 will be there for a while. I'll get it. Don't worry. And then finally, finally, after all this time, I have got True Blood, Season 7, the final season. I just started watching this. I'm up to Episode, episode 7. Yeah, so I've only got like 7, 8, 9, and 10, and I'm done. And uh, I like this season a lot. I don't know if I like it as much as I like 5 and 6. I think 5 and 6 were pretty damn good. This is kind of meandering. I, you can kind of tell that they're just trying their hardest to tie up as many as many uh, loose ties as they can. You know, it, it you definitely feels like a last season. But it's okay for what it is. So, yeah, I got this also from Amazon. This was nice and cheap. This was like... 20 bucks. So that's it. That's my Amazon Cyber Monday Blu-ray, or my Cyber Monday pickups. Tell me what you think. Do me a favor. Subscribe. Comment. Leave a video if you want. I don't care. Uh, well, I do care. I care if you do any of it, but I, I just want to see you get involved and, you know. So like I said, that's it. You got True Blood, Season 7, the final season. Simpsons, the 11th and 12th season, and of course, Being Human, season one. So yeah, tell me what you think. Do you watch any of these shows? Do you like any of these shows? Do you hate any of these shows? I want to know. Again, comment, subscribe, like, share. With that on the 13th Wolfman, of course I'm on the prowl.